Oh, this is a weird angle that we haven't explored before. How exciting. Hey everyone, welcome back. This is downstairs of my house. We haven't been here before. I've been away from YouTube for a while and it's been really nice to have a bit of a break. But, um, yeah, I just felt that I've been lacking in something. So I figured I'd just chuck on some mascara. Um, put my hair up and we can just try to make a video. A few days ago I saw that one of the people I follow on YouTube doing a tag and it is the small booktuber tag or the small YouTuber tag. 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 Yep. Um, I'm sure you can read the title of the video, that's exactly what we're doing. Basically just introducing you to my channel. I've been here for a while. There's like 200 of you that follow me. Thank you, everybody. But I just wanted to do this to introduce myself to everyone um, if you haven't really known who I am before and to shout out some other small booktubers that I really like to follow because they make some good stuff and they deserve to be recognized as well. So that's what we do today. The first question in this tag is just to introduce yourself. So hello, I'm Michaela. I am 25. I am Australian. And my channel is Pixie Pots, as you can also read, I'm sure. Fun fact, I'm also an occupational therapist, so that's what I do as a day job. Number two is how long you've been on YouTube. So I have been on BookTube and YouTube since 2016, I want to say it was. And I know it was February because the first one I did was a February vlog. I'm pretty sure that video is on private now. <laughs> I think I unlisted that one. Yeah, so... I've been here for a while. I have been inconsistently making videos for that time. I think I have stints of on and off. Um, I think this is probably like the longest stint that I have had on, even though I've been off for the last month or two. We're about to get visits from my dogs. Hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> What's up? Oh my god. Hi. This is Cora. Um, she wants to be a part of this as well. Cora is an Australian cattle dog or a blue healer. Um, she is great. She broke her leg when she was nine months old and snapped it clean in half and is now walking again because we got it fixed together with a metal plate. So that's one of the dogs. The other one will make a visit at some point, I'm sure. Number three is what kind of videos do you make? So I'm a part of BookTube. I make BookTube videos. Oh, hi, silly. <laughs> I told you there'd be another one. What are you doing? What are you doing? This is Sylvie. Sylvie is a border collie. Uh, she is a lilac merle border collie. And she is nine months old. So she's still a puppy. She's a very good puppy dog. Yeah, you're a good puppy dog. So apart from just the normal booktube videos that people make, um, usually there's like wrap ups and hauls and unhauls and things like that. Uh, the only real like booktube videos that I make are I do monthly or bi-monthly wrap ups. I also regularly do reading vlogs. I also do tag videos like this one. I don't know what I want to do with this channel, um, just as like a sidebar from this question. I have really wanted to branch out into lifestyle. That's generally what I watch on YouTube. But in saying that, I don't think I'm quite ready for that yet. So I'm going to stick to what I know, and that is booktube and making videos about books. I'm also really trying to make my videos better. So better quality, better editing. Don't super know how to do that, but we're working on it. Coming. If you have any suggestions, let me know. And number four is what do you love about booktube? I think the thing that I would have to say that I love about booktube is that the community is the best. I think that everyone says that about the booktube community and it's so true. Everyone is so lovely and so friendly and I have never had any hate comments or anything like that on my channel and I think that that is something that's just really pure about the booktube community and so yeah, thanks booktube. That's what I love about you. Number five is what kind of books do you read? I generally tend to stick to fantasy, young adult, romance, and sci-fi. Those are like my go-tos. I have tried to branch out from there occasionally and I'm still working on it, but those are generally the areas that I like and that's probably what I'm gonna stick to. I do have some other genres on my shelf that I am interested in reading and that I will get to, but for now, that is where I'm at with life. That's what I like to read, and so that's where we're going. Number six is the 
favorite video that you have made. I have a few categories for this. There's the video that I'm most proud of and the video that is my favorite. So the one that I'm most proud of, and actually there's a few of them, so they all kind of lump into that category, but it's my organization and tour videos. I'm really proud of them because I put a lot of work into them and they take such a long time to edit, but it is so satisfying watching it all come together and what, sort of, what comes out of it is usually really, really good. They're the ones that I'm most proud of, but I think that my favorite one so far is my moving blog, which is where I moved into this house. And it was a basically a week where I vlogged um, the process of us painting and doing all of the changes and stuff to this house and then moving into it. It's my favorite video because of the feelings that it reminds me of. It was a really stressful, but also very fun section of my life. And so I like to kind of just rewatch it every now and then and remind myself that we did this. So yeah, that's why it's my favorite. I wish that you could see Cora sitting just there above the camera. She's so cute. And the final question, which is question number seven, is shout out for small booktubers as well. Oh, I should have mentioned at the start, I found this tag through Elizabeth Ann Books. She got it from someone else whose channel is called Soleil, Soleil, some kind of word like that. I'm really sorry I didn't write it down, but I will put links to both of their videos in the description as well if you want to check them out. So I won't include them in the four that I'm shouting out, but they are both also small booktubers since they are doing this tag. Our lighting is different because I'm refilming this small section. I just went to edit this section and I realized that I did a terrible job of filming it. So I'm going to try again. Question number seven is shout out for other small booktubers. So here we go. Let's do this again. First booktuber that I want to shout out is Pages with Paige. She is another Australian booktuber that I follow and I really like her channel because A, she's really consistent with her posting and that's amazing. B, we have really similar taste in books and I think that's really consistent throughout all of my recommendations for this video. And C, or three, you can really see how much she has improved even from the time that I've been watching her. Her videos have just like exponentially grown in quality and production and I really admire that. Um, and I kind of look up to it a little bit as well. So that's Pages with Paige. Number two is Emily Hunker. I'm really sorry if I've said that wrong. Um, I found Emily's channel actually through Elizabeth Ann Books' last small booktuber shout out. And the thing that I really like about her channel is the persona that she has on camera is really amazing. And the quality of her videos is incredible. It just feels really genuine when you're watching them and I think that she should have way more subscribers than what she actually does. Number three is Just Martine. Just Martine is also a booktuber, obviously, but actually does some other stuff as well, like productivity, studying, vlogs, that kind of stuff, a bit more slice of life, which I also really value. It can get really boring sometimes when it's just books, in my opinion, which is why I kind of try to spice things up with my slice of life as well. Hello. And the last person that I wanted to... Yes, Sylvie. You want to shout them out too? The last person I wanted to shout out is Martha May Books. I really like her channel because she's quite whimsical with her aesthetic um, and she has the most beautiful accent. Um, yeah. But yes, those are my shout outs. And that was the small booktuber tag. I don't know how tags usually work. Am I supposed to tag people and get them to do this as well? If you want to do this tag, feel free to go ahead. I'm tagging anyone that wants to have a go at it because, I don't know, I feel like it's something that is good and it's a really nice way to find new booktubers that are also small, like myself. So, thank you for watching. This is me. Welcome to my channel. If you're new, hello. Um, I'm not usually this, like, chaotic and unkempt, <laughs> but, yeah. Hopefully we will have some good new things on this channel in the future. I am taking a bit of a step back at the moment just because things in general life are getting crazy, but YouTube is still a really nice outlet and I'm still reading, so there's that. So if I'm not posting, that's why. Please don't unfollow me for that reason. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.